Hey guys, Ms. Bird here. Today in this lecture, we're going to answer the question, what is a nomad? So a long time ago, over 7,000 years ago, people didn't live in houses or even in one place. Instead, they moved around from one place to another. Why might people have moved around like this? If you said that they were looking for food, then you would be right. They were hunter-gatherers, which meant, means that they wandered around gathering whatever fruits, vegetables, grains, and nuts to harvest. They would also hunt whatever animals were around them. People who live like this are called nomads. A nomad simply means a person who wanders or roams around. Pause, take a note. Nomads gathered their food from the land around them. They would eat plants that they picked, roots that they dug out of the ground, and nuts and berries that they gathered from bushes and trees. They might even eat small reptiles like lizards and snakes. Pause, take a note. So everyone in a tribe or a clan or a group of nomads would have a job. The women and children would be in charge of finding food in the area, like fruits and berries. Children might be in charge of killing things like lizards and small snakes. Men would hunt meat with spears, bows, and arrows, and if they were camped out near a lake, they might even hunt fish or go fishing. Pause, take note. But imagine you are one of these nomad tribes and you have been in one place for a little while, and the women and children might have found all the fruit and vegetables and, that could be found in you know, the walkable distance, and the men had been hunting for a while, and maybe the animals kind of figured it out and you know, moved on away from these people who were killing them. So after a while, what happened? Well, there wasn't really any food left there. So if you're a nomad, what do you do? If you said that you pack up and you move somewhere else where there is food, then you would be right. Pause and take a note. So where did nomads live? What did they live in if they didn't have houses? Well, they would have things like tents that could be packed up really easily and moved away. They might also come across caves that they could live in. Pause, take a note. If you're wondering how do we know so much about nomads, it's a really good question. One way we know all this is because they painted in caves. They left these cave paintings behind that we can still see today. And it shows the kind of animals they hunted, um, the kind of social hierarchy inside of their groups. So we can figure a lot out. We can kind of piece together the pieces of the puzzle there. Pause, take a note. And that's all for What is a Nomad? See you next time.